Rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. No, that's not Deborah's voice you hear. That's Randy's. Deborah will be back with us on the next show, I hope. Uh, in the meantime, I'll try and fill in a little bit, and Terry will do the rest. Yeah, isn't that how it always is, Randy? Pretty much. <laughs> Terry does it all. <laughs> okay, we are back here at the shelter. We've got Randy with us. Well, Randy's always with us, but you never hear him these days. But today he makes a special appearance as the announcer. We have big doings to announce, Randy. What are they? Okay, this Saturday, which is for you out there, uh, October 24th, we have a volunteer here named Joan, and what Joan does is train these little Chihuahua dogs to be good lap dogs. And Sarah here is one of Joan's protégés. Joan is 80 years old on Saturday, and what she wants to do, Randy, on Saturday... What's that? ...is to pay half adoption fee... Half? Of all of the animals all at the shelter. Them? Yes. Any animal who gets adopted on Saturday will have half their adoption fee paid on the spot. That, Joan, is amazing. Isn't that amazing? That is an amazing gift to give, and hopefully we'll get a whole bunch of animals out of whole here. A whole bunch. Now, this is cats and dogs. Cats and dogs. Any animal in the shelter, cat or a dog, and I think even a rabbit. You might go for a rabbits rabbit. as well. Yes. Will okay. be adopted well, on we've Saturday. Well, unicorns, half price. <laughs> That's this Saturday, which for you, if you're listening, the t uh, 24th of October. Joan will also have a birthday cake here. She likes to celebrate her birthday with a cake. Well, if only to get some cake, you need to come down here to the shelter. And she will share her cake with adopters. Joan would be thrilled to see so many animals get out of here on her birthday. So if you want to make Joan happy, and she is a gal that you would like to make happy because she's quite a gal, come on down and adopt at half price any animal at the shelter. And we've got an awful lot of cats also, which you'll see later on in the show. So we need your help adopting cats and dogs. So that's Joan's big birthday blowout. I call this Joan's birthday blowout and Joan's generous gesture on her birthday. Oh, nice. That's very alluring. We'll see you on her birthday. Now, Sarah. Yes, what about Sarah? What, this is Joan's protege. And Joan guarantees this to be the absolute best dog here at the shelter. And I want her to go fast. Sarah, look at her, how she sits here, Randy. Well, tell us about Sarah a little she bit. She is a major lap dog. I mean, major. She's in training. She's seven years old, so she's had some experience being a lap, lap she's dog. She's not a puppy. She's not going to go crazy on you. Exactly. She knows her stuff. She'll just get on your lap and stay there, as she's doing with me. Look. There I she mean, is, being is a lap dog. You can take this dog anywhere. If you have a backpack, you can slip her in your backpack, and she's ready to go. Hey, let me give them Sarah's ID yes. so they know who to ask for when they call. Her ID is 207556. That's Sarah. And here's Sarah's message to everybody out there. Let's take she a close wants look. you yes. to adopt her. She's That's wearing Sarah. the Adopt Me banner. So please adopt Sarah. And we've got many other dogs to show you. Sarah's not the only dog, but we'd be very happy to see her go fast. So that's so. Sarah's 207-556. We're looking at little Chance here, Randy. He's a doll. He is a cute little guy. This guy is crate trained. I know a lot of people like a dog that's crate trained because then they can leave him at home alone and he stays in his crate and you know no damage will be done. He also sits for trees and he's a darn nice little guy. Chance's number, in case you're interested, is 208-223. He's also a senior, which qualifies him for a senior rebate. How much? He, you get $35 back on Chance if you adopt him, and he's only nine years old, so he's got a lot of life left in him. Ooh, little dogs live almost forever. I know, almost forever. So, Chance, a bargain as a senior, 208-223, cute as he can be. Well, what we're going to say here, Randy, is it's Miller time. Do you know why? Well, I have no idea. It's Miller. <laughs> oh, hello, Miller. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm sure if you want to have a couple of beers, kick back and have a couple of beers, he wouldn't mind that either. Yeah, Miller would probably be real friendly with that. He is. He's a very friendly guy. He is um, anxious to go for a walk, but he needs a little training on that walk because he wants to be in the lead all the time, and you've got to tell him who's boss. Well, that's not hard to do. You just be consistent, and he'll be trained. He can play with some dogs here, but not every dog. He is dog-friendly, but he likes to pick out the dog that he wants to like and play with. Miller is ID number 207396. We've got Penelope here up next, Randy, and she's kind of shy. It's going to take the volunteers a little more time to bring her around. Or a good home. Or a good home. That would be the best thing. But she, she's really coming around now. 
If you can see, she's got one blue eye and one brown eye. A lot of people like that distinction on a dog. And she's the wonderful breed of the Bull Terrier, which is very, very popular. And as you can see, she has those great ears. She is good with other dogs, she is sweet, and she is wonderful, and she likes her belly rubs. So, if you take Penelope, you're going to have to get your belly rubbing up to par. Her ID number is 208112, and she's just a year and a month old, a just babe. A youngster. A youngster. She's going to come around fast once she gets out of here, I can tell. 208112, Penelope. Hi, Sherman. That's his name. His name is Sherman, and he just likes to lounge around. He is a really good lap dog. He likes his lap time, but he always likes. He also likes his leash time. Happy, energetic, and very socialized. This this guy can do it all. Everything you want in a little package named Sherman. And I think he's so cute, Randy. What do you? He think? is the cutest little thing. I'd put him on my lap if I wasn't behind the camera. Well, you're going to have to wait until later to take Sherman and put him on your lap. Anyway, look at him. He's showing you everything he's got. So well adjusted. So nice. ID number 208587. Unlike our other lap dogs, this guy likes to be a kind of a knee dog. He turns upside down so he can get his belly rubs. He is a whole lot of fun. Well, he's bigger than most laps, so that's the most he can fit. Yes, he is, but I think he's a big beefcake of a dog. He's a very nice boy. Volunteers love him. He's just about three years old. His name is Vato. I didn't give his name. His name is Vato, and his ID number is 947726. He's strong. You have to be strong to have a dog like this, but he's lovable, and a face like that, extra lovable. Look at him. How can you resist? Vato, 947726. We've got a newcomer to the shelter. This is a dog that we found in Grover Beach, the 600 block of Mentone Avenue. That's in Grover Beach. She came to us on the 17th of October. She is female. She's five years old. She's got a very distinctive look, Randy, don't you think? <laughs> it is amazing the way she looks. Eh? It is. So if you, this is your dog, you'll know it straight away. Or any neighbors looking at this dog, whose ever dog this is, with her punk hairdo there on the top. Let them know that we've got their dog. We figure she's about five years old, and uh, if she doesn't get claimed by her owner, she's going to be available for adoption, and we're going to call her Kelly. Her ID number to identify her is 208777. Terry, this dog walked in, sat down, looked at Sandy, waited for instructions, obviously knows how to follow orders, a well-trained dog. Yes, unless he's an actor and he has been on TV many times and then he knows exactly what to do when he goes and hits his mark, Randy. Well, he hit it perfectly here. That could be possible, too. Of all the things this dog knows and likes to do, I've got one thing to say about him. He likes to play volleyball. <laughs> when have we had a, ball, a, a dog on who likes to play volleyball? Oh, we've had a few soccer players, but no Right, no volleyball volleyballs. Player. Well, anyway, he's a volleyballer. Now, we're calling him Mick. That's a great name for him. He's great on a leash. He's house trained. He's calm. He's obedient. He sits for treats. He's loving. You can see that he's just a perfect all-around dog. He's a senior, so we get a rebate of $35 back to you on him if you adopt him. And his ID number is 208666. That is Mick, the volleyballer. This is a pretty small dog. This dog is sitting down now, but I think wait, this wait, is... Wait, wait, wait. Where's the dog? Oh, there oh, it no, is. There the it dog. is. I am zooming, zooming, zooming. There's the dog. This is a wonderful girl. Also likes lap time. This is due to Joan's training. And this is, remember, Joan is having the half adoption fee paid on every animal here on Saturday. The Joan's big birthday blowout bash. October 24th. Samba is one of her animals that she has trained to just be like that. Just as you see Samba, that's what she does. She is great on a leash, she's house, house trained, she's sweet, she's happy, and I think this girl is going to make you happy too. ID number 208525, and if you come down and get her on Saturday the 24th, she will be half price, along with everybody else here. You know, Randy, I wonder half the time how volunteers find out things that they know about the dogs. Like, how did they know that Mick played volleyball? Did, you know, hmm. how, how do you know things like I that? I just set up a volleyball court somewhere, I guess. Well, we've got Charlie here. What do we know about him? Charlie, we know, loves deep tissue massage. Okay, which volunteer was doing deep tissue <laughs> massage on Charlie? I don't, I don't know, but Charlie loves it. So if you like to give deep tissue massages, 
Come Charlie. volunteer. Oh, yeah, come volunteer. We could all use one. But anyway, that is uh, Charlie's claim to fame. He's easy to walk on a leash, even though he looks like a big boy. He's very loving. Clearly. And I think he was kind of mistreated in the last place he was. So we really, really want him to go to the best home. You see his chopped off ears there. Not so nice. Yeah, he's still a great dog. But we're going to put that all behind us, Randy. And Charlie goes forward into a new and happy life. His ID number is 208484. Bone up on your deep tissue massage. I really like Lenny's looks. I think he is very, very handsome. I like that little brindle over the white. Really nice touch. I think he's going to get you noticed if you go walking around town with him. Don't you think so, Randy? I think anywhere you take this dog, they're going to be stopping and talking to you. Once again, the volunteers have discovered that he loves belly rubs. Well, what dog doesn't? I know. He knows Sid. He's a very nice boy. He loves his toys, and he will walk by your side. Lenny's ID number, 208160. I don't know, Rindy. You know I love black and tan dogs that look just like this. We are going, we're calling her Topaz. She is just about five years old. She is a very nice dog. The volunteers say she's mellow and sweet. Topaz ID number 208664, and I think she's going to get you noticed. I think she'd make a great jogging companion. That's what I see her doing, jogging, hiking. Don't you think she's outdoorsy? Dogs, companions, it goes together. Look at those beautiful white teeth as well. Anyway, her number 208664. Here's a newcomer to the shelter. We found this dog on the 17th of October. She was found in Paso Robles. She's just about a year old, and her ID number is 208776. I love this one, Randy. This is a cutie pie. This is Loretta, and she was just looking up at me like, when are you going to start talking about me? Well, they all wonder that. They want to be the star. They want to be the star, and she is. She is so calm there, just sitting with Stan. I love her. She is one of Joan's. Uh, students in training to be a lap dog. I think she is a graduate. Look how Either. well Just she does. Just hanging out on your lap. And remember, everybody out there, Joan's birthday, October 24th, there'll be cake and there'll be half adoption fee on every dog and every cat in the shelter. Imagine. And Loretta is one of those dogs. So if you like her, come on down and meet her and get her for half price. Her ID number is 208721 Loretta. Well, Randy, we've got cats, we've got dogs, and we've got ponies. <laughs> this may be a full-size horse. Joan will pay half adoption fee even on ponies if we have them. And Tiger kind of gets into that category of a little pony. Anyway, he is very strong, but he is good. He's a good walker. I think he'd be a great hiking companion. And volunteers give him high marks in the personality department. He's got personality. He's got personality. His ID number is 954097, and he's only a year old. This is a puppy. <laughs> That's, he needs a little training for that puppy, but, yeah, he'll be all right. Okay, so come on down, meet Tiger. Ride him if you want, 954097. If you're going to notice anything about this dog, you're going to notice Randy fill in the blanks. Uh, would it be the rabbit ears? It would be the rabbit ears. We are calling her Athena. For what reason again? Do we like Athena? Well, I looked at it and I saw some ancient Greek something or other mm. going on there. I see a lot of smarts in this dog. Wisdom, Athena's wisdom, right? Okay. She is only a puppy, though, so that's a big name for a, a young gal. She'll but I grow think into it. She's going to grow into this. Athena is just six months old, a puppy. Her ID number is 208747. And yes, she also will be available at half price on Saturday the 24th. So... Come and visit with Athena, 208747. Randy, I'd like you to meet Cimarron. Well, hello, Cimarron. Isn't that a nice name? It, somehow the color, the look, everything goes with Just that name. Just fits him. I know. It's a really good name for a really strong dog, and he is that. Although this dog would like you to spray him with your hose if well, you get him. Everybody likes to get a little uh, shower once in a while. So I think you have to keep that in mind when you come down and meet Cimarron that he will be expected to be sprayed with a hose. He's a very nice boy. Volunteers give him high marks in all departments. He's good on a leash, appears to be house trained. A plus, A plus, A plus. Now you want to know his number to connect with him. It is 208735 Cimarron. 
this is a very smart dog. Here we have a Queensland healer, one of my favorite breeds. This is Bryce. Let me introduce you to Bryce Randy. He is going to need a job, as do the healers and the border collies and the Australian shepherd dogs. They These, all like to stay busy. Yes, they, they need do. need a purpose. If they have a job, <laughs> they're happy. And people complain because they're too busy, but that's their nature. So pick out the right dog for you. This one needs a job. Bryce is friendly. He's active. He's smart. He is ID number 208274, and I think he's a handsome, handsome boy. He's a beauty. He's just two years old as well, so a youngster. 208274, Bryce. This dog is very young. He is just two years old. He is a lab type dog, very active, very high energy, Randy. I think with some training, he is going to be a stellar, stellar dog. Every dog needs to be trained just Every to make him happier. Well, this guy, yes, and I think this guy will enjoy his training. He's very, very smart. We're calling him Stosh, which I think is a pretty, um, what? Uh, it's an interesting in name. Yeah, interesting <laughs> name. We're giving the, him the name Stosh. I think he can carry it. His ID number is 208741. He's just two years old. Handsome, gorgeous Stosh, 208741. So we advertise ourselves as the best pet store in the county. Here I present you with a Boxer, one of the most popular breeds in the United States. She is a calm girl, as you can see. I think she's got a distinctive look about herself. What do you think, Randy? She is a good-looking Boxer, mm -hmm. and I love the brown and white. She's just nice. She's just nice. She's calm. She's easy to handle. I think she'd be a delight in any household. We're calling her Anita. If she doesn't get claimed by her owner, on the 20th of October, she'll be available for adoption, and that puts her available for you when you come down here on the 24th of October to adopt her at half price in all the other dogs and the cats at the shelter. Anita's ID number is 208703. Sweet Anita. I see a pair of very distinctive ears on Allie. I like the look of her. She's a very sleek black dog. Easy maintenance on that short tight coat as well. Just medium size too, not a great big dog. Exactly. She's got everything going for her in that department. She also knows sit and shake, Randy. Well, those are good things. That means she's trainable. She could be trained to be anything you want her to yes, be. Yes, she's young, a year and a month old, so she's just over a year old, and this is the perfect time to start that training. All dogs need training. This one in particular could really use some training. She is ID number 207936, and her name is Allie. Oh, Randy, this is little Petunia. She's just two years old. Her number is 208302. She will not disappoint you, I guarantee. And I present still another lap dog we to you. We got a ton of lap dogs here this week. Yep, this one says lap dog training in progress. Well, I think she's about ready to graduate because look, Give Kelly her a had diploma. no trouble. No trouble whatsoever. Right on to the lap she goes. She's happy. She's high energy. She makes me smile when I see her. Her name is Sally, and her ID number is 208462. She is a sweet thing. 208462, Sally. Well, Darby is standing up, Randy, to show you his size. Well, how about showing us that brindle coat? That what brindle a beauty coat. that is. This is oh. going to get you noticed. This dog will get you noticed. They might not remember you, but they will remember your dog. We're calling this dog Darby. He is um, a Mastiff and Siberian Husky, we think, combo. I don't know. He's somebody's a, guessing. Somebody's guessing. I think he's really an all-skate, as we say. <laughs> or a who's your daddy, as we say. Uh, he's just about a year old. And his ID number is 208699. For his size, he is very gentle. Very, very gentle. He's obviously calm. Just look at him. He's just hanging there, talking out. Okay, connect with Darby. ID number 208699. Well, now we've got an awful lot of cats to show you once again. We've got cats. We've got kittens. All sizes, all shapes, all colors. But one thing they all have in common is they all need homes. So let us consider starting out with Milo and Otis, two darling orange tabbies. Look at those faces. They're just bookends. They've lived their entire lives at the shelter. Can you imagine that in this small space? They have lived together. So if you, knew, if you need two cats that get on with each other, Milo and Otis are terrific together. 
Milo's number is 207-730 and Otis 207-729. Okay, next up we've got Athena and she is a very playful girl. She was hitting every toy she could get her hands on and playing with other cats in other cages. She is a delight. She's also our volunteers pick of the month. That's right, volunteers decided of all the cats here, this is the one they would most like to adopt and get out of here quickly. So half of her adoption fee has already been paid for you. Athena's number is 206402, and she is volunteer's pick of October. What a doll. Well, now you're looking at Georgie, and he is a very handsome uh, gray and white tuxedo. We don't get a lot of gray and white tuxedos here. Black and whites, yes. Gray and whites, not so much. He is just about six months old, once again, spending most of his life here at the shelter. His ID number is 207682. That's Georgie. And here we have another pair. This is sneakers and socks. Yes, they've come together to the shelter, and here they are in these small cages with each other. If you need two cats, sneakers and socks could be the two twosome for you. They are both boys. ID numbers 207749 and 207747. And remember, if you get two cats together, you get a two-cat rebate. That's great for you. Sneakers and socks. Hamming it up for the camera. Say hi to Tammy. Tammy is a very gentle soul. She's just about two years old. Her ID number is 208672. And she is kind of a little scared here at the shelter. She was turned in by her owner. They moved and couldn't take her with them. And that's Tammy's sad story. She really needs to get out of here fast. ID number 208672. Please consider Tammy. Hi, Peaches. Isn't she gorgeous? This is a long-haired calico. That's Peaches. She's also a senior citizen. She also has half her adoption fee paid, which is great for you. Half of her adoption fee has already been paid to motivate you to come down here and get Peaches out of here. This is no place for any cat, no less an older cat. Her ID, ID number, 191271. That is Peaches. Well, this cat's claim to fame is that he has the softest fur imaginable. I think you're going to have to come down here and pet him to decide for yourself. This is Midnight, and as you can see, he's a black and white tuxedo, and as you can see, he loves to be petted. He also has a guy down below him who likes to play with his paws. Not much to do around here, as I said. Midnight's number, 208243. Well, I will admit that Dusty looks a bit glum. Yes, he does. He doesn't like being at the shelter. None of these cats like to be at the shelter. Anyway, Dusty's here for adoption. He is all gray, as you can see. We have a lot of fans of all gray cats. If you're interested in Dusty, his number is 208299. Well, Licorice had been, has been very, very patient waiting for his close-up, and he's given you his all. He's quite a delightful cat. Loves to be petted, loves to be on the lap, loves to be held. He is your all-around great cat. Licorice ID number 208238. And as you can see, a black and white tuxedo. 208238. So we've got yin and yang here. These are two buff on whites. They are both boys. Ying's number 208471. And Yang's number is 208. 470 yin and yang now you're looking at bambi bambi has been here since august can you believe it i can't either she is a doll she is shy but she's coming around and i know for sure if she gets out of here she is going to be the best darn cat for everybody and anybody bambi has half her adoption fee paid because we really 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 are motivated to get her out of here she, this is no place for her so half her adoption fee paid a Beautiful, beautiful cat. She will be your best friend. I guarantee it. Her number is 207678. Been here since August. That's pathetic. Come on. Get Bambi. 207678. Toby is such a handsome boy. Look at his eyes. He is a tabby on white and really, really good looking. Toby is ID number 208628. He's an all-around good boy. 208628. This cutie pie is named Sophie. She is a doll. She's just about six months old. You can see she's a tabby on white. ID number 208624. Sophie. Here's a big, handsome gal. This is Princess. 
princess is eight years old. That makes her a senior. She's eligible for the senior rebate of $35 back to you if you adopt her. She is ID number 208592. Princess. Here's a very attractive pair. We have two gals here by name of espresso and cappuccino. So if you're a coffee lover, these are the ones for you. And I'm sure they'd like to have their morning coffee when you're having your morning coffee. We have cappuccino, whose number is 208575, and she's the one with most white. And in back, we have espresso, 208574. This is a newcomer to the center. We found this cat on the 14th of October in a Tascadero. Do you recognize him? ID number 208698. If not, he'll be available for adoption. Here's a big handsome boy. This is Bear. Bear's ID number 206276. You Siamese lovers, here's a Lynx Point Siamese. This is Sally, and she's a very young one. She's not even a year old. ID number 208604, and her name is Sally. 208604, Sally. Well, here's a big, beautiful tabby. Really, he's a Maine Coon type. If you like that type of cat like I do, you're going to love Cal. He's just about a year old, very handsome, very friendly. ID number 208661, Cal. Okay, you guys, this cat is a Torby, mm, borderline Calicorby, and Manx to boot. So, if you want an unusual cat, this is the one for you. Her name is Fawn. She is female, ID number 207679, and she has been here since August, grew up at the shelter. That is just not right. So consider Fawn, ID number 207679. Another Lynx Point Siamese, best pet, best pet store in the county, I say. You Siamese lovers, here's Max. Just about a year old, ID number 208660, Max. Next up, we have an all-white cat named Diamond. She is female and two years old. Very pretty girl. ID number 208327, Diamond. May we suggest these bookends? We have Mork and Mindy here. Mork is the black and white, ID number 208450, and Mindy is the all black, 208451. Once again, two cats go together. These two get along very well if you want to, and you get the two cat rebate, Mork and Mindy. This is Patootie. She is eight years old. That qualifies her for the senior rebate, and her ID number is 145836, Patootie. Well, look at this lineup. One, two, three, four, brothers and sisters all together. We have got kittens, I'm telling you. We need you guys to come down here and help us out. Get some of these little guys out of here. This is no place for them to grow up, and so many of them just spend their whole lives here at the shelter before they get adopted. Months and months. Let's not have that happen. Tell your family and friends. If you're on the fence about adopting, please come down and help us out. Take out a cat or a kitten. You won't be sorry. They'll be your friend forever.